Are you listening? Welcome back to the Nerf Report. My name is Bryant. And for today's show, we have a very special treat as ARK Survival Evolved has finally arrived on Google Stadia. Now, originally, this game was announced as coming to Stadia back in October of 2021, but was inevitably delayed from the spring launch window with developer studio Wildcard promising the game would be arriving in the summer of 2021. And with summer officially ending in 21 days, I've gotta say, good job, Wildcard. Now, if you are unaware of what ARK is, ARK Survival Evolved is a survival adventure game where players must gather resources to build homes, grow farms, craft armor, and you get to tame frickin' dinosaurs! ARK is home to over 107 different types of creatures, including dinosaurs, pterosaurs, reptiles, invertebrates, mammals, and fish. And while the majority of these creatures can be tamed and used to help you conquer the ARK, many of them, and I mean many of them want to do nothing but kill you and eat your flesh. In fact, one of my very first videos here on YouTube is me trying to beat Ark but taking a shot after every time I die and well, here's the result of that. Get back, Bubba! You don't know me like that! I killed a dragonfly! I killed two copies, a dragonfly, Nothing killed me, but I died. I don't even know anymore. Now, another thing that we probably should point out is that ARK currently offers 10 different maps that each feature thriving biomes, unique creatures, and distinct challenges. My personal favorite is the center map, as they have some really cool caves that you can actually build your base in. But if you're looking for something that's a little more challenging, Scorched Earth is definitely the one that you need to check out. As you find yourself in the middle of an arid desert and your dehydration meter is just constantly going off like that stupid fairy from Zelda. And with Ark Survival Evolved arriving on Google Stadia, it is important to remember that it is included with your Stadia Pro membership. But if you're not a Stadia Pro member, you can still play the game, it's just going to cost you $29.99. And if you're wanting to jump on other maps, the base version of Ark does offer some alternatives. However, the Ark Genesis maps, Aberration maps, Scorched Earth, and Extinction maps are all DLC add-ons that you can buy through the Google Stadia store. Now, for the big question on the majority of the internet's mind, I already own Ark Survival Evolved on insert platform here. Why would I ever want to rebuy this game? And as someone who owns Ark Survival Evolved on Xbox, PC, and PlayStation, I'm really adopting Stadia as my platform due to storage space, as the base game plus DLC for Ark is roughly like 140 gigabytes of storage on my PC. And since Stadia is a cloud gaming platform, all of of my storage is at the Google data centers. So I'm looking forward to freeing up all of that space on my consoles and PC. But as always, that of course is just my opinion. What do you all think? Are you hyped that Ark Survival Evolved is finally on Google Stadia? Should we remake that drinking video game and God save my soul, I hope you say no. Uh, let me know what you're thinking in the comment section down below. Hey, thanks again for checking out our channel. If you like what you saw and you want to see more content just like it, which who wouldn't, uh, hit the subscribe button right there. And while you're down there, hit the like button. Maybe even consider becoming a Nerf Report best friend, just like the people listed down below did. In fact, don't you want to see your name there? I know I do.